This is the new world of Zelda. Hey guys, what is going on? My name is NoJ456, and today I have a little bit of an Easter egg bust for you guys. A lot of people I've seen on forums, I've seen YouTube videos, a ton of people are thinking that they found a GTA 6 Easter egg in GTA 5. It's just a miracle that anyone found this thing in the first place. But this is the reason a lot of people thought this was a GTA 6 Easter egg. So as you can see here, this, this does look like a GTA 6 Easter egg. It does look like something that they would use as a logo. It does look like something that they would, uh, uh, they would kind of put out as promo, something to get us hyped. Kept you waiting, huh? So I started thinking about it. Of course, GTA 6 will be years off yeah. at this point because it was, what, five, five years between... We'll probably four. catch it at the end of this console cycle. Closer to it. We should be getting the trailer in a couple of months from now, and then a couple of years later, we'll get the game. Pokemon Go has only been out for a few days but it's already got millions following their smartphones to the most random places. Oh my gosh. The GTA 6 cover release? Are you freaking serious? There it is, Grand Theft Auto 6. You guys thought this was bullshit, but it's here. Woohoo! There may in fact be a release date hidden in GTA 5 for the next Grand Theft Auto game. So what you guys want to do is make your way down to the airport to this location right here, which feature the number 2021, which at first doesn't seem all that significant, but there are also a few other doors which feature the number 2013. Now the year 2013 is very significant to GTA 5. That was the year that GTA 5 was in fact released. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. It has been 400 days since Rockstar lied to us and said we will update everyone again soon regarding GTA 6. Now, if you don't know, supposedly Grand Theft Auto 6 is going to be taking place in Vice City. I love Vice City on the rug. That's a GTA 6 Easter egg. There was someone online who leaked that they were building a landing page for Take-Two Interactive and that they would be announcing a brand new title somewhere in E3 for 2019 in Los Angeles. Then there have been some messages that state that Grand Theft Auto 6 is coming out in 2019. I just want you to know that not a day's gone by when I haven't thought about it. The 4chan thread was posted by an anonymous user with the Rockstar Games logo that said March 25th, Grand Theft Auto 6. Now that is the only thing the entire thread said. They didn't provide any sources or proof or anything like that. We came here to announce GTA 6 being released in May of 2020. It'll be out this Christmas. I just... I don't think I can ever forgive you for that. I don't know where he gets this information from, but a few days ago he posted a mysterious post that reads, The trailer of GTA 6 is closer than you think. Looking at how popular this person is on the internet, I doubt that he would be making jokes on us. We all fail. We all make mistakes. This picture might be the first look at GTA 6. This is a man-made picture by someone at Rockstar Games, and it is using the Red Dead Redemption 2 engine. It's been a long while. We are pleased to confirm that the active development for the next title is underway. Like, I, I've, I've got chills. I've, I've had tears in my eyes when I first saw this. Today has gone down as one of the biggest leaks in gaming history, as genuine GTA 6 gameplay has been leaked on the internet and spreading like wildfire. It really is the final countdown now, as it looks like Grand Theft Auto 6 is going to be officially announced in October this year. All the dates we had marked on our calendars just passed by, and we didn't get any from regarding the title. Today we'll be talking about why November also has real potential to be the month of the announcement. My wife works in a position where she's able to see the trailer for the next Grand Theft Auto. I won't say more than that as to protect her own job working with Rockstar. Rockstar blatantly teased GTA 6 on Twitter yesterday. There's clearly a VI there, and I think it's too coincidental for them to only show off the VI, I mean. Everyone's focused on the VI, but it's actually the other side of the image, the moon. If we take a look at the moon phases, the waning gibbous, 79% illumination, 
happens on October 3rd. So there's a chance this week we get the announcement. Rockstar's publisher announced that next fiscal year they will be making over three billion dollars more than they normally would. There is only one game in history and certainly only one game in Take-Two Interactive's portfolio that can even come close to making that much money in one year. And it's got people speculating that you've got to have Grand Theft Auto 6 coming out. So we've said that we're working on the next iteration of Grand Theft Auto, but Rockstar hasn't announced a release date yet. A brand new leaked audio tape just got released into the public of the Take-Two Interactive CEO actually confirming the release dates and also the upcoming announcement dates for GTA 6. An announcement is expected to be coming from Rockstar's side very soon. This is coming October 23rd, actually. We recently learned that you have registered the domain name GTA6.com. We prefer to settle this matter amicably and request that you immediately arrange for the transfer of the gta6.com domain name by no later than 3 p.m. BST on October 26th. October 26th. October 26th. October 26th. That might be the day we've all been waiting for. So I was wrong about the GTA 6 announcement date. <laughs>